Are you tired of dreaming about starting your online business but feel stuck because of the costs? Wondering how to turn your passion into profit but don't know where to start? If you have been asking yourself questions like, how can I do this with little to no money? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am excited to chat with you about something that's been on my mind a lot lately. How to start a small online business without a big investment. Now I know many of you are probably feeling overwhelmed. Maybe you have been dreaming of launching your own business but are worried about the costs or perhaps you have tried to start but just don't know where to begin. Let me tell you, I have been there too. A while back, I wanted to start my own venture but I was lost in the sea of information, feeling like I needed a fortune to even get started. It was frustrating and I felt stuck. But over time, I learned some valuable lessons that I wish I had known back then. And today I want to share those with you. I have also put together a special checklist that will help you guide through the steps of starting your online business. Trust me, this checklist is something you won't want to miss. Also stay tuned because I will be reviewing a package I received from Nihao Jewelry, a Chinese wholesaler with trending affordable products, perfect for reselling in your own business. And you can find the link in the description below. Plus, I will be sharing a discount code to help you get a domain for only 99 cents. So don't miss that. Make sure to like this video, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can never miss out on the tips of growing your online business. Let's jump right in. Step 1. Find your niche. The first step in this journey is to find your niche. This is essential because it's what will set you apart in a crowded market. Ask yourself questions like, what are you passionate about? What do you enjoy doing? What skills do you have that others might need? Do some research to see what's trending on your chosen area. Use tools like Google Trends or even social media platforms to identify what people are currently interested in. This way you can position yourself in a market that's hungry for what you have to offer. Step 2. Source products with low investment Once you have identified your niche, the next step is sourcing products, ideally without spending too much. This is where platforms like Nihao Jewelry comes in. They offer a wide range of trendy affordable items that can be perfect for resale. When I was starting out, I worried about how to find quality products without spending a fortune. But now, with Nihau Jewelry, you can order in small quantities, which is a game changer for any budget. Their vast selection means you can find items that resonate with your target audience, whether it's jewelry, accessories, or beauty products. They offer a wide range of trendy affordable products from jewelry to accessories and more. Nihau Jewelry made it possible for you to purchase items in smaller quantities, which meant you could test the waters without a huge financial commitment. Plus, buying from Nihau Jewelry, you will have a good profit margin when you resell. Now, let's take a moment to review the package I received from Nihau Jewelry. I ordered 10 pieces to show case today and I can't wait to share my thoughts with you. Let's sit back for a while and enjoy the unboxing and product review. Here's an aesthetic preview just for you. Get ready to explore these beautiful items in detail.
Overall, I am really impressed by the quality of these products from Nihao Jewelry. These are just a few examples of the quality and variety Nihao Jewelry offers. If you are interested in reselling or just want to check them out, I have linked everything below. Step 3. Build an online presence. Let's talk about building your online presence. You need a space where potential customers can find you. It's easier than you might think. Start by creating a professional website. I know it sounds daunting, but platforms like Shopify or Wix are super user-friendly. You don't have to be a tech genius to get started. And here's a little secret. You can snag a domain name for just 99 cents. For the first year using code BMK15 at dot storage domain. I will drop that link in the description below. Having a custom domain gives your business credibility and it helps customers remember you. Don't forget about social media. When I began sharing my journey on Instagram, I was amazed at how quickly I started connecting with people. Share your story, show behind the scenes content and engage with your audience. It's a powerful way to build a community around your brand. Step 4. Leverage free and low cost marketing tools. Marketing is key to driving sales, but it doesn't have to be expensive. Use free tools like social media, SEO, and email marketing to promote your business. For example, I used to struggle with marketing, but I quickly learned that posting consistently and using relevant hashtags could significantly boost my visibility. For example, I started by using social media to showcase my products. Engaging posts and stories can attract attention without spending a dime. SEO, which is search engine optimization, is another critical tool. Make sure you are using relevant keywords on your website and social media. This will help you appear in search results when potential customers are looking for what you offer. And don't overlook email marketing. It's a fantastic way to stay in touch with your customers. Platforms like MailChimp allows you to start for free. And collecting emails from your audience means you can share updates and special offers directly with them. Step 5. Keep costs low with smart ordering. As your business begins to grow, one of the biggest mistakes new business owners make is overspending in inventory. But the key to low investment business is ordering smartly. And here's a tip, consider using a pre-order system. This means customers pay upfront, allowing you to use that money to order inventory without financial strain. I did this during my early product launches and it helped me learn which items my audience loved the most without having to overcommit financially. It's a smart way to keep your cash flow healthy. And again, with wholesalers like Nihao Jewelry, you can keep your initial orders small, but still receive a great variety of items that appeal to different customer tastes. This helps you maintain a positive cash flow and avoid holding on to excess stock. Nihao Jewelry's low minimum order quantities also make it easy to test new products. So that's it. A complete guide on how to start online small business without a big investment. Remember, the key is to start small, be smart with your purchases and leverage free tools to grow your business. And if you're looking for a great supplier to get started, definitely check out Nihao Jewelry. Their range of affordable, high quality products is perfect for anyone who's serious about building an online business. Before you go, don't forget to download my special checklist linked in the description. It's packed with actionable steps to help you start your online business journey effectively. If you have found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more online business tips so stay tuned and follow me on instagram and for behind the scenes updates and inspiration thanks for spending your time with me today i can't wait to see you in the next video bye